If you are facing the problem of Facebook's unique account identification policy or the same problem you are seeing on the screen right now, you're in the right place. So I recommend watching the video till the end to reactivate your account. I faced the same problem sometime earlier, and have now recovered my account with some of the steps that probably no one has ever shown to you. This may sound little silly but if you didn't believe me, here is the screenshot of the mail sent by Facebook. They verified my account after 7 days of deactivation by sending the mail which says, thanks for confirming your identity. We've unlocked your account, and you should now be able to log in. We're sorry for the inconvenience. But before going into this process, you should be able to figure out why Facebook disabled your account. Basically there are four reasons that Facebook may disable your account. The first one is the fake profile that you may be using and Facebook recognized you as the fake account user. Second one may be the main reason of your Facebook disability that you've used the same phone number or email for creating multiple accounts. This may be due to the end-to-end -end encryption policy for Messenger that Facebook is planning to implement. They are just trying to make Facebook users unique with just one Facebook account like WhatsApp, where only one account could be created from one phone number. Third is, if you've shared the pornographic content to anyone or to any pornographic groups you are attached with. And the last one is, if you are sending the bulk message, or spamming or sharing something inappropriate in Facebook, sending requests to anyone you're not familiar with, commenting multiple inappropriate things and so on. So I recommend you to know why your account was disabled so that you'll be safe from future issues or policies not by doing the same mistakes again in Facebook. Now let's go into the account activation request process. This account was disabled on December 30th, 2021. You can see here that I can only log out from this account as it has been disabled by Facebook. Now just go to the help center and Facebook will prompt you to the help center where you can fill a form regarding the account activation process. Here comes a appeal profile disable form. Now listen carefully. Just make your identity ready and snap both front and back part of it. Any of your citizenship or your driving license will work and it should sample like this. This should be on a same picture having proper visible edges of the identity. Note. Facebook only accepts this types of pictures. Just select the picture you just made for identification. The additional info here is optional but you should write something stating why you need this account. Make sure you write the text being as formal as you can, including your email even your Facebook URL if you know. It helps the teams to identify your account. Now copy the written text for the second step, and click on send. Now going on to the next step. This step will be your major step for activating your account. Log in to the Gmail on which your account was registered or connected to. Now go to the description of this video and you'll find a link which has different email of Facebook support. Copy all of the email and paste in the head of the email like shown in the video. Add a subject that defines your problem and paste the same text I've told you to copy previously. Still don't forget to add your email, URL of your Facebook account and phone number that your account was connected with. Ok time to send the mail. Congratulations you have done all the things from your side. It's now Facebook's turn to decide whether to activate your account or not. I have done the same process to activate my account and hope this works for you as well. And if this method worked, then come back after the account activation, and like the video and also subscribe to my channel.